Hey everybody, my name is Blacktrack, and welcome back to Pimp My Ride for the PS2. Last time, uh, hold on, we took on Alex, and now we're going to move on to the next customer, Ayana. Ayana, right? That's how you pronounce her name? Hold on, uh, <laughs> I'm illiterate as fuck, so, yeah, Ayana, alright, cool. Sometimes I misspell things, and I wasn't sure if I was misspelling the name or not. Alright, cool. So we're just going to take a quick look at all the rest of the people. Not that I'm I'm almost positive I showed them all off. But at the end, we will be taking on Exhibit's Challenge. But that's not until episode 16, the final episode of these uh, Pit My Ride videos. But anyway, let's just go back and uh, we're going to take on Ayana, who I accidentally missed. Here it is. And her 92 inks, I believe. Why didn't I edit this out? Because we're going to take on Ayana. I don't know what I'm doing here. Okay, whatever. It's Ayana, all right. 92 inks. <laughs> Good, past John. <laughs> uh, I'm going to drive around in the Pol Popularis. I, I don't know why I keep saying Polaris. It's not the name of the fucking van or whatever. Anyway. <laughs> so uh, this map isn't too bad. And uh, we're just going to kick things off by going straight to the pipping phase. <laughs> pipping. An Enix, huh? This thing is such a dump. I'm surprised the garbage man didn't take this out with the trash this morning. <laughs> Let's go see who's attached to this thing. Yeah, I've clearly been mispronouncing shit. Why'd I call it an Enix? I don't know where bro. <laughs> Ayana, what's happening? Oh. My. God. Oh, I'm far from God. I'm here to pimp your ride. Excuse you. This has got I to be God. one of the worst looking cards <laughs> I've ever seen. Please tell me you didn't dig too deep in your pockets for this. I put $3,000 into it. But where did it go? Damn. Damn. So, I just got this new paint job because it was cheap. And it's already blistering and peeling off everywhere. Just a word to the folks out there, don't go for the discount paint job. Judging from your interior, I'm guessing you're not the first choice in transportation among your friends. <laughs> Why would you say that? I don't know. Maybe it's the shattered glass all over the seats. That'll make it a little uncomfortable. So, what were you thinking with the body kit on this thing? Hey, I did it myself. Yeah, exactly. All right, Ayana, I got to take this death trap from you. Let me get those keys. So, uh, how the fuck do you manage to get glass on on the seat and not... I don't know. Alright, whatever. We're gonna move on. So, the three main things for this car are the interior, the paint drop, and the body kit. And, uh, those are probably the most important parts on, uh, this car. Sorry about the sniffling. I'm recovering from a cold that I've had for like over two weeks. Anyone else get colds that they just don't apparently like heal from after a while? Like all the other major symptoms go away. It's just you're you're still nasally. You still talk like I don't know. Whatever. Anyway, so let's uh, not do any of the three things and give her some uh, nice spinners. I think these are the spinner wheels at least. So uh, <laughs> clearly I know what I'm doing. I'm a master at this game, apparently. <laughs> um, everything actually seems to be out of the way. Uh, they all seem to be connected. The paint job and the body kit are right next to each other, but I don't see an interior... Uh, what's it called? The interior seller. I may have not gotten the supplier, so that's probably what happened. I don't remember. It's been like a week since I've played through this game. Actually, I think it's been like Saturday since I've played through this game. I don't really remember how long ago that was. Almost a week now, I guess. Um, <laughs> but, uh, yeah. So, I don't really have much to talk about today since I woke up like an hour and a half ago to record these videos. But, um,. Yeah, it's just, I, I've been I've been watching clips from this show, and I, I I totally forgot how ridiculous the cars look, and 
it's just uh, oh my god like in real like these cars are i'm not gonna lie to you are like the cars in the game are not far from what the show has, has shown off <laughs> if you haven't seen the show like they they were pretty ridiculous and like just really tacky looking cars uh <laughs> like it was it was pretty ridiculous this show is is definitely one of those like early 2000 shows that like either you've seen and know and like it or just never heard of and are just like why was this a thing like this show is, is just one of those types of shows and it was oh my god it's so entertaining <laughs> it's really entertaining like in a really bad way it's kind of entertaining like this show was really enjoyable to watch because of how ridiculous everything seemed including like all the crew and stuff that like worked on all the cars and all the ideas that they they put in to the cars and it's like I can't believe people would actually drive around and like I don't know <laughs> Just like, like who would have what is this a metal shopper like who would put a fucking what is this huh? toolkit wallet like who puts a welding kit in a car that fucking anvil I think this is the one I picked I picked like the electro forge and anvil like yo that doesn't seem too far out of the stretch of something that they would do in the show like I feel like I forgot the name of the dude who did like the, the trunks and stuff like I feel like that's just something that would actually happen in the show and it's just like I and, like they're they're really ridiculous looking cars like I'm not gonna lie to you <laughs> like I, I just saw a clip of I don't know what car it was um, but like they had the exterior is like this really like lime green color with like a red wing and like red tires and or sorry red, red rims and then like in the inside there was like three xboxes stacked against each other and i was just like yo <laughs> this is overkill what the fuck is it? and that was like one of the more like non overtly ridiculous yo, cars man, that they've done so you that I, I was just like rewatching. oh cool an exhibit challenge all right neat so uh, I'm glad that I was running low on time because Exhibit warned me of the impending doom of running out of time. And uh, I need to know where the Exhibit Challenge is. But luckily for me, it's right next to the, the I almost called it the pay and spray. <laughs> the spray paint shop. So that's useful. So I can deadass just stop by the Exhibit thing, grab a free part, and um, and then that grab a free part and then uh just swing on over oh shit more free time it's <laughs> yeah i forgot about that that's great <clears throat> so this entrance always confused me because like it says that the entrance is right here but the way to get in is is kind of annoying like it's easy to get in from the other side but since i for whatever reason always end up driving the other way it's kind of a pain in the ass to turn in there so what let's see what kind of weird vinyl graphics i decided to put on this it was definitely the anvil and hammer wasn't it yeah i i did ask i think i put the anvil and hammer yeah because i think that was the best looking one for like this car not that i would actually do any of this on an actual car or anything i don't know maybe if you like it I don't, i'm not gonna judge you or anything but like i wouldn't personally do that um but yeah but with all those time frame stops and uh, not time frame stops, with all those uh was time stops like the damage stuff and the exhibit challenge it ended up giving me enough time to give me like 20 extra seconds on top of however much time I had left, which is really useful. Um, super useful. I should have turned there and, and just kept going, but I don't know why I didn't. I think I had enough time to make it to the body kit area. I think 25 seconds is more than enough. 
but uh, I'm not sure if I do make it. I think I'm losing. I think I have my bar is slightly better than their bar, but they have two exhibit challenges, and that might do it. Let's see. Can I make it? No, oh, I keep crashing into trees. Oh, I ran out of time. No, oh, I could have made it if I didn't crash into that tree. All right, let's see if that's more than enough. It was flatlining when we picked it up, but we brought it back to life. So now, check out your brand new ride. Whoa, that is awesome. <laughs> Come on, let's take a closer look. Now you see these, Ayana? These are Streetworks Tribal Spinners. I have spinners. That is so cool. Spinners. Meanwhile. <laughs> all right, so check this out, Ayana. This is your own custom paint job. Oh my god. Oh, that is just so cool. I love this. Thank you so much. So what about the other pimp? Were spinners like right, really popular out, back it's in the early 2000s? It's a TLX 500 10 disc DVD player with an automated fold down monitor. Oh, that is awesome! I'm Thank gonna ask you. Her. But take a look at the other whip. Now, Ayana, I've seen what you're working with, and man, they're huge. I mean, really big. So I'm guessing you need some serious tools, right? Well, like this one, maybe. It's an anvil and a forge, and plus a suspension lock and hydraulic support legs, so you can hammer and beat and bend as hard as you like. <laughs> no freaking way. Oh, God, that is awesome. But you know we got two customizers working for you, right? So check this out. You do a lot of work from your ride, right? Huh? That's probably Apparently. why I wound up being so beaten up, I guess. But not any longer. We hooked you up with reinforced doors and improved parking brakes. Oh, cool. But check <laughs> this out instead. Oh, neat. This thing that's actually so, useful. You see cool. Both rides. Oh, I have a fucking this anvil in my car? My Dope. Yard. What? <laughs> oh, you better pick my car. Oh, my God. That's what I thought. I love this. That's what I thought. All right, just one more thing. You, you officially, officially been, been pimped. pimped. There you go. <laughs> I love that line, man. That line cracks me up every time. So they pick our car, and let's see how close that I, I uh, that I won, uh, and very, very close. Anyway, y'all, that's everything for this video. I'll see you guys for Jason. You've all officially been pipped.